It is finally time. This is what we've all been waiting for. I know one of them has a battery forge on him. It's finally time that we put on some dragon armor. I've been waiting for this moment. Boom. Bada bing. You can't see my eyes, but my nose kind of looks like eyes. My nose holes. I don't appreciate you. Chaotic energy is manifested into something. Beware. Look, it's an Argus. He's like in the floor, though. I don't have arrows. I don't want to fuck up the durability on my armor set yet. I still want to enchant my armor set. Let's fight this Argus, though. Because we can summon it, right? <laughs> nice. It's with a tough, some tough soul. Okay, so we should we should enchant this whole entire armor set. Now, the question is, how should I go about enchanting it? Should I enchant it straight up and have a possible chance to get an enchantment I don't want on it? I mean, there's usually not enchantments you don't want. Or should I enchant it, uh, you know, via just anvil and books because we could probably get exactly what we want it might be a little bit more expensive i don't actually i don't know and it is time that we enchant this armor we're gonna start with the chest plate obviously fire protection unbreaking fire protection is ass um, that's no offense to fire protection i have a bobble that literally does not allow me to take damage from fire so yeah i think i'm gonna take that off and just put a uh, regular on it regular uh, protection regular protection is the best right fire protection four Oh shit, we broke the armor. See, I probably shouldn't have done that. <laughs> no, we lost our chest plate. I wasn't thinking at all. I forgot that breaks it. You know what this calls for? Dragon round two. There's still that green one that we can fight. But green dragon armor looks nasty. If it looks nasty, then it suits you well. That's fucked up. So there was a dragon out this way. Dragon, don't be too high up, please. I'm not trying to fly that high. Where are you? Oh god. Wait, let me strike the other direction. It's all good, donkey. My wrist already hurts from this. I'm trying to aim for headshots. They do more damage. Also, tail shots do damage. Hey, can you come down a little bit? It's not easy shooting at him at this angle. So the reason why I'm not using like the better arrows is because they usually bug out when I use them and they like hit me. But they don't do damage. They just like bounce off of me and do nothing. Am I hitting him? What was that? Can y'all fuck off? I'm making this harder. Fuck these things, dude. Not a good time for a game to freeze. How much health was he at? He looked like he was at half. He got kind of close right there. <laughs> Let's not get that close again. Wasn't my choice I got that close. He kind of flew near me. Calm down with the lag spikes, though. Come on. Where are you flying? I feel like Dragon's Fire should not go that far at all. Because I feel like, you know, we're fighting up here in the sky. When we hit the floor, like, be ready to see the fire everywhere. How am I missing this? I feel like some of these arrows, they're just like momentum just drops. Come on, hit him. Directly underneath me. These should be some body shots. This is so hard. I'm having so much trouble aiming right now. Fight me! Stop trying to run! I'm getting cold up here. There we go, he's dead. Get that XP though. Honestly, more important than the dragon itself. With the XP go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, what happened here? Jesus Christ. Donk, you stay over here, okay? What is that, Ash? Where's this falling? Don't fall into fire. Alright, get everything and let's get the fuck out. Well, there you go. That's another dragon dead. I think we've kind of mastered the art of killing dragons. Even though it is a little painful to my wrists. You're like, gamers, you're complaining about your wrists a lot. I have had tendonitis slash carpal tunnel, like, 
effects on my wrist like my wrists have hurt really badly in the past they don't hurt as badly anymore but they do hurt every now and then it's really hard to turn my wrist certain angles so me i was not able to take damage the whole entire fight because i'm fire resistant donk he got hit like once because he's not fire resistant maybe if i throw a fire resistance potion at donk you think that's like a little hack we can do but this dude dropped 41 scales god damn the scales are literally only used to make armor so there's no reason for me to just keep it <laughs> you literally made to make armor okay there we go we got our armor back oh god two of them are kind of bad I'll, i would say four scales and i'll get a good reforge perfect 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 magic shielding is great this okay i fuck with this green this green is nice i look like a uh, the doom doom guy is that his name doom guy i gotta sneeze <laughs> okay i felt that sneeze on my face huh <laughs> the only way i'll go into another to get xp is if i go naked i doubt that once i go through this portal there's a million things did you remove your baubles of course i removed my baubles look at this shit Hey, I came here to get XP. See, like, what is <laughs> this dude said? Nice try, bro. You're playing RL Craft without the most important mod in the pack. First aid. The thing is, he commented this on the first video. And in the first second of the first video, if you look in the bottom right, that is the first aid mod. <laughs> like, I don't even want to read the rest of this. <laughs> like, he's already wrong in the first, like, second. Boy was serious, though, with that comment. Like, he, he was trying to, like, reply to the top comment on that first video. He was like, he's not even playing with the first aid mod. These wisps, they give a lot of XP. We have no levels right now. Watch how many levels we get from killing. Four straight up four. That's great. You should see the people getting so mad in the comments. This is fucking hilarious. People like if I do something wrong at all, they get they like write like a paragraph about how I did it wrong. Like I think I said that I'm scared of Enderman. Like the two vanilla mobs I'm scared of are Enderman and Creepers. He's like, how are you scared of vanilla Enderman? They're literally the easiest mobs next to zombie. It's like, calm down. Just my opinion. Taking it a little too serious. <laughs> Just playing some Minecraft, bro. Motherfucker, how did I know that was gonna happen? Get a griffin. I have one, but it seems you don't know that. I wonder why. <laughs> oh shit, there's an alpha. <laughs> My bad, bro. What is the range? What the fuck is this range? What the fuck is he gonna kill me? He's crazy. All right, boys. Got a little something for you guys to take care of. Just hold this down for a little bit, even though it's buggy as hell. Aggressive, of course. All right, let's do it, boys. Right here. Who's over there, an ant? There we go. Handle that, boys. He's going for my Uva Raptor. You guys stay away from me. Yeah, this is what you get. You get fucking jumped by the boys. This is what you deserve. Look at his range. He's still hitting people. Fuck you. Over here in this direction, there's a little place known as the Defiled Lands. Why is there a bunch of cows on this roof? You know, there's a lot of things to get done here. A lot of cool things. The only thing that sucks is that there's some animals that spawn here. And I cannot bring them home because they're too damn far from my house. Well, I can. It just would take literally forever to bring them home. But the name of the animals, they're called bookworms. I'm very scared of that royal mirmex. Don't fucking touch me, okay? You don't touch me, I won't touch you. But yeah, the name of the, the creatures here, there's one right there. They're called bookworms. And they're really, really cool at what they do. And that's why I want to bring them home. But, uh, you know, we'll we'll see what we can do with it. But yeah, there's a boss here. I'm just I'm just going to come straight out and say it. There's a boss here. So these bookworms, um, you can feed them like enchanted books. Say like you have an enchanted book you don't want. You feed it to them and then they like poop out another enchanted book. Something like that. Let's test it out. We, we might waste our XP traveling back and forth. But let's test it out. I want to see it in action. Hey, you want some books? Look at him. He's following me now. Do I just right click on him with books? Okay, okay, he's doing something. I see the concentration. Are you gonna poop out another book? Please don't walk off. Get a bookworm in a book. I took him home. Oh, oh, you heard that? He pooped out a new book. See if I can get my hands on it. And he pooped out Sharpshooter 1. Please protect our speed. That's not bad. That's not bad. But this is another way we could have got Infinity. But I did not know they did this, so I didn't have the knowledge. But yeah, I definitely want to take these guys home. But it's gonna, it might take, take a while to do that. I hate taming Lycanite mobs because they still attack you even when you have, like, the thing you're trying to tame them with. All right. So we picked up this Scuttler Eye from that spider. And this is where the guns come in. Remember I was talking about there's only a couple guns in this mod pack? Here they are right here. The Umbra Blaster and the Ravager. Oh my fucking god. Let's get the shit out of me. So loud for no reason. I'll make sure my head is on point. That sounds sus. Never mind. What? Oh shit. I want to know how he hit me, like, from behind. Because he pushed me towards him when he hit me. He's the one that hit me. Slender man. We actually need to kill those guys. 
because they drop an item called the black heart which i think we got one yeah black heart which i think we need to summon yeah oh shit we have enough we just needed one so let's go ahead let's compare sizes wait let's go ahead let's compare skull sizes this is stage three this is stage four. Oh my god the difference between a three and a four what what does this stage five look like you're getting blasted right here you i'm sorry for this but you know i gotta test out this weapon i'm sorry yale just stop moving for a second Did not expect that at all. Okay, not as strong as I thought, but obviously it doesn't have the highest stats. But let's see how much health the Yale has now. It's almost dead. I don't know how much health the Yale spawned with. Did I say 11 health? <laughs> Finally, a regular size rabbit, bro. I fucking hate rabbit. 